my god! Who's hitting that high note? Hello! Wow, it still squeaks. I'm so surprised. Uh, hi, how's it going? Welcome back to the channel. Uh, we kind of have a surprise here. I was not expecting to do this. I was about to listen to Kepler for the first time, but I was reading the comments. I just posted on the community tab, so if you want to go suggest a song, just comment down below if you have any suggestions for anything. I read every single comment, so yeah. Um, but Stacy, I love Stacy. Last time I listened to Stacy was uh, ASAP, and I I mean, I did have like a seven month hiatus, so I did miss a lot. And even before the seven month, I was just off and on for like months at a time. So really it's been like a year and a half since I've uploaded consistently and like kept up with things. And I want to say ASAP was like song of the year contender. It was so damn catchy. That chorus was amazing. And they literally just released the song like a minute ago. So. We're just gonna dive into it. I know I missed some Stacy music videos that if if I really enjoy this probably, or if I just enjoy it, I don't have to really enjoy it, I'll go back. And I'll probably go back anyways just because I already really enjoyed ASAP and their debut. So uh, it seems like here I missed two music videos, Stereotype and Run To You, which both did very well on views. Like both are already over ASAP, I think almost run to use at 51 but stereotypes they're most popular now so they are just growing and if i'm remembering correctly i'm pretty sure isa was my bias or isa or isa isa she was my bias i'm pretty sure the music video is called beautiful monster i am interested i am interested that's an interesting title Wait, like, jesus christ dude they don't give us a second anymore it just instant. Stacy girls, it's going to anyway. Yeah. Oh. Oh wow. Isn't this rapper girl? Wait, hold on. Isn't this rapper girl? Okay, technically it just says vocalist rapper Machne. So she's also a vocalist. I just remember like she had she's the one with the deep voice, right? I guess you kind of hear it a little bit. I would that caught me off guard. Wow. Okay, that's that's the bias. I know that. This is such an empty song so far. Okay, there it is. I mean, I liked it. Wow, wow. Bro, she always comes with the looks. That's Yoon, right? Oh, I thought we were going rap. We're gonna go rap still, I think. Right after this. I can feel it. It's coming. It's coming. It kind of counts. Bro, since when? Bro, she was like, did I miss something in the last year? I swear her voice was like raspy. Like, I can't even go as deep as her. And now she's like singing all smooth and angelic. What? What did I miss? I miss so much, apparently. She's gone. Red looks great. I just mentioned stuff about red hair in my one of my ESPA videos, saying I don't like bright red, and now they keep proving me wrong. Done. This is such an interesting sound for them. I've only heard two songs by them, so it makes sense for them to change it up. Damn, they're watching their own movie. 
There it is. There's the voice. There it is. There's no rap break or anything. Oh my god! Who's hitting that high note? Even know who the main vocalist of this group is who the fuck just hit that so i looked at the the positions and seems main vocalist so i'm guessing it was her i know which one that is i like i can point her out but that was amazing i really like that ending i gotta give this another listen though because i need to like pay attention to the lyrics a little bit i love how they have their own thing like of course other groups have done that like Blackpink, obviously, in your area. You can do so many different ways to say it. Like, I mean, they change it up here. Just like the different tones of the way they say Stacy Girls is going down. It's such a simple thing. Stacy Girls is going down. It's going down. Anyway, yeah, and I really, I like how the song starts off so empty with just the like acoustic feel. Because it really, it caught me off guard. Because with Stacy, the last two songs were pretty hyper and active. Which the song does get active. I'm going to pay a little bit more attention to the lyrics. I think they're pretty basic love song lyrics. But I don't really care too much. Does she actually play guitar? Question. I feel like she does. This chorus is amazing. They have mastered choruses already. That's her. That's her. That's the main vocalist. I I I know her face. She's the main vocalist, a hundred percent. And from that ooh note that I was about to try to do, can't do that. She almost has like a little rasp in her voice too. I really thought there was gonna be a rap break here. Like Jay is singing. It's not really like a rap break though. I'm not complaining though. No. A song without a rap break nowadays is kind of a W, you know? And they have a real big tendency to give you the best outfits. Like, this outfit's kind of matching with all the other ones, but the cool, like, hat thing she had going on earlier, just dope. And she had those, those glasses in, I think it was ASAP that she had those cool glasses in. She just likes wearing dope stuff. They're literally watching a theater of their own music videos. Stacy Theater. Damn, they built this looks real. This is real. They built this. This is all real. Wow. Okay, that's actually pretty cool. I like that. Girl definitely has to play guitar. What is her name? That's like the only name I have not had yet. So no, Sayun and then Siyun. I remember I had problems with that because they're so similar. Uh, Sayun is the main vocalist, and then Siyun's the one that's playing the guitar. The, with the, the orange hair, okay. I got it. God damn, I forgot. I forgot. I am a fan. I really enjoyed that. They, like I said, they have mastered the art of the chorus. Uh, so bad's course was fantastic that whole song wasn't fantastic asap's course was fantastic that whole song was amazing more than fantastic this this song i think the course stands out but not not a lot because the regular the the regular uh verses are great too and i love the acoustic start man i like this song a lot now i went into this like not expecting anything because i really kind of oh, i didn't forget their sound but i mean it's been i missed two three comebacks so they could have changed up drastically and they kind of did but not like not in a bad way so fresh and spring feeling like it's it's got like a summer music video aesthetic going on but it doesn't sound like summer it sounds like spring i don't think the music video or the the lyrics were anything to die for or anything special stand out uh, the music video wasn't bad. I, I don't think the lyrics were bad either. There's nothing like crazy cringy. They're they're actually pretty unique for like a love song. They like switched it up a little bit, uh, but still basic love song lyrics with a little pizzazz on it. The music video fresh and it gave off the message of 
that spring vibe, which I like. Uh, but the standout here is the song. And it's like usually all my attention, or at least for the last two tracks I've listened to, all my attention is on Isa or Jay, which this time Jay, yeah, she sang and it sounded great. But I really liked the main vocals. Like she really went off there at the end. And it, it like it was like so good. It was like piercing my earlobes. But overall, I, I this is like a 9.5. I guess the only lacking things I could even find are no cool ass deep voice rap. Uh, but it really wouldn't have fit the aesthetic. They would have had to do the regular like switch up there that I was expecting and they didn't. So that was a breath of fresh air actually. Uh, but other than that, the music video, you know, kind of just plain, not plain, but is just a music video. Like it's not a music video that you're going to be like, this is my favorite music video of all time. And these are my favorite lyrics of all time. I mean, the lyrics aren't actually, they might be someone's, but the music video is like nothing crazy special. The looks are all right. The outfits were all right. I really like Yoon's outfits. She, they put the craziest shit on her and she pulls it off. But yeah, let me know your guys' thoughts on this down below. Uh, if you agree, disagree with anything I said, uh, I, I'm always honest. All right, I don't bullshit anymore. I'm done being fake. Um, I was never really like fake, but there were definitely times where I was overreacting a little bit where I was like, holy shit, guys. I mean, I probably still will do that when Blackpink come back, but I, I want to be real with you. I love this. <laughs> and to you in stereotype. Uh, I'm going to check both those out. Maybe in one video, maybe in two. We'll see. Uh, depending on how much I like them, because then I'll want to talk a lot more about it. Seriously, thank you guys for watching. Uh, if you want, comment some recommendations down below. Anything about Stacy Girls you want to let me know, I am open to anything. And if you made it this far in the video, comment Stacy Girls. It's going down because you're a real one if you made it this far. We've been recording for like 20 minutes, so I love you.